greetings my friends and welcome to this video and once again my friends we have been hit by the technical problems the technical gremlins have reared their heads once again to bring down yet another uh, campaign and once again is the Ottomans involved now I wanted to be absolutely honest with you here my friends and let you know what has happened um, I loaded up the one of the save games I from the last time I was going to do two episodes of the Ottoman Empire campaign, and I was just going to do one of the Austro-Hungarian Austri Empire campaign. So I was going to, and then next time would be I'd be two of the Aust Austrian-Hungarian and one of the Ottoman, just to, just to keep things sort of fluctuating and keep them things a little bit fresh. We get one of the other, two of the other. Went to load it up, went to, to end the first turn, um, back into the campaign, came to the French um, turn, game crashed, completely crashed, back to the back to desktop. So I thought it might have been a glitch. I always keep two save games of the same sort of of the same turn I end on. Went back to went to the second one, exactly the same turn. Came up to the French turn, down it went again, my friends. I don't know what has happened, but for some reason the same fi save file on that is corrupted. So I went back uh, th to the previous turns, tried to replicate what I did to bring me up to where I am now at the moment. Same thing happened again. Got to the French turn, completely crashed. So something is happening there with the French turn, where no matter what I, how far I go back or what I do differently, um, you know, I've tried to go e even get into the game, try and change things about, you know, move my troops from different parts, turn them around. Every time it gets to the French turn, it completely just goes straight back to desktop. Doesn't even freeze the game. Completely crashes it back. Bang, we're out. I've I've been literally about an hour trying to get it sorted. So. Unfortunately, it looks like I, I'm not going to be able to continue this Ottoman Empire campaign and it really does upset me a lot because I've been enjoying it so much. I know that many of you are enjoying it as well. I've got a lot of Turkish um, viewers and subscribers who have joined because they've enjoyed this. You know, watching back and looking back at how, you know, their empire, the, uh, the Turkish Empire, how vast it was, how magnificent it was. It was a glorious empire um, back then. I know they, they, you've enjoyed seeing it. I've enjoyed playing it and I hope all of you have enjoyed watching it as well but I just got to be honest with you my friends it looks like this has come to an end uh, in terms of where we are now at the moment but here is what I'm going to offer you here my friends or offer what you want to do this is your channel as much as mine in fact it's probably more your channel than it is mine because you know I love playing in Empire Total War and all Total War games and I really do enjoy it but for me the enjoyment is is also getting the feedback is getting that interaction with you as well enjoying using your advice, using your tactics to, to mould and sort of, you know, form my strategies, my tactics for the things. It's, it's absolutely fantastic. It's, this has been one of the best things I've ever done, it for, ever, is putting my YouTube channel up. And that I genuinely mean that. It's been one of the best things I've ever done because of the enjoyment of what it gives me as well, of the, of being able to talk to all of you day every day and read all your comments every single day. It means absolutely the world to me. It really does. So this is what I'm going to offer you, my friends. I can either start the Ottoman Empire campaign completely from scratch. We're only eight turns in, so it's not it's not a huge amount. Sort of eight episodes in, so not a huge amount. It's quite a lot of turns, but it's still not a, It's not like fifty or a hundred turns. You know, when sometimes you can get these campaigns, you're hundred turns in, and it all of a sudden bang goes down. That's the worst. So we're quite we're quite f sort of you know early in the campaign. So I can start it again. That wouldn't be a problem at all. Or I know that a lot of you have been asking for the Mughal Empire campaign, uh, for me to do a Mughal Empire campaign for a long, long time. So, I'm, I'm, whatever you, if you want me to do that, I will definitely, definitely do the Mughal Empire campaign. I said if any, and then my next one would be that, or, or my friends, in conjunction with the Mughal Empire campaign, if that's what you want me to do, I could also do another mod. Um, fortunately, I have two laptops that can handle. Yeah, Empire playing Empire Total War. Now there are a lot of mods out there, and I know many of you've been asking for me to do the American Civil War, the Blue and the Grey. Um, and I know a number of you have also uh, mentioned um, uh, the Imperial Splendor uh, mod as well. So what I'm going to offer, or su su not offer, or suggest, my friends, or put out there is, if you want me to do the Mughal Empire campaign and another mod campaign as well, I will do that as well. So what you'll get is, you won't get two, if you if you want the Mughal and another mod campaign, unfortunately I won't be able to do two Mughal campaigns and then two of the new mods. What I'll do is I'll do one Mughal Empire um, um, 
episode and then another episode of the, uh, another mod entire entirely different mod and that's how that that will work I won't be able to do two or three of each I'll only be able to do one and then another of the other so you get one one episode of each each time they come around in that sort of in the cycle of the episodes um, or there's plenty of the mods I've, got, I've actually got them here on the screen with me there's the American Civil War the blue and the grey there's the American, American Revolution mod um, there's the a proper empire terror I incognitia there's a British East India Company uh, the Indian Mutiny mod there's the colonization 1600 AD mod Empire Realism European Wars 2 18th century mod Imperial Destroyer um, there's Imperial Splendor uh, Regalia of Nations the Rights of Man the War of 1812 and then we've also got the War to End All Wars now I don't think the end the war to the War to End All Wars is actually a completed mod. I don't think they actually got it completed and set and and sort of released. So that one might not be available. That's a World War One mod. I don't think that has been completed. If it is, I've read about it. It is still quite um, buggy and it still can hang and drop the campaign quite significantly. So I probably err uh, off using that one. But any of this, any any of this you want to see, or if you just want to see a brand new mod. A completely brand new mod, nothing to do with Empire Total War, but one of these brand new mods on here, I will do that. Or if you want to see one Empire Total War one and a new mod, so I'll do one of one of the Empire Total War of the new ca of the new sort of nation, and I'll do one of the new mod, and you get that every cycle around. Then so it won't be two of each, three of each. It'll be one of each. Or I'll do the Ottoman Empire campaign, start again, go from a prop. It wouldn't be a problem at all, my friends. And the most important thing is. Please decide what you want to see. Don't don't do what you think I want to play. Do what you want because I enjoy playing Empire Total War and all the mods and any Empire any Total War game I enjoy playing. But you know what I'm like with Empire Total War. It is almost an addiction with me. So if you want so please let me know what you want to see. It's really really important to me that you what you enjoy what I put out. It's really really important. Let me know what you think, my friends. Put it down. Put it down in the, in, in the in the comments. You can message me privately. You can you know you can Google Plus me. You can you know thumbs up if someone puts a suggestion. Thumb it up. You know let them. You know the more basically the the, the suggestion that gets the most sort of you know yep yeah, that's one we want to see or the one that gets the most sort of in the description. Everybody wants us to write it down. Keeps and else the, the most common one keeps coming out in all the in all your comments. That's the one we'll play. And that's the one we'll go for as well. And doesn't matter what it is, I will do my best to try and get it up. Now, with the if you want to see a new mod, it'll be on my other laptop, um, which I um, that won't be out immediately. What I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this video run for th this video here. I'll see what the comments are. I'll give three or four days for the comments to build up. Let people want, people see what they want to do, what they want to see, and then I will start the new uh, the new. A campaign or campaigns should I say depending on what you want to see let me know and if it is a brand new mod you want to see that might come a little bit later in the next round because of course I've got to get it set up I've got to test it to make sure it works and it runs fine I don't want to start it and all of a sudden it starts crashing I get problems with it or I can't put it out for whatever reason because if that happens I want to let you know so I can say to you look I can't get this mod working let's have a look at something else but of course with Empire I could put out any Empire campaign straight away that wouldn't be a problem so if you ask for a Mugahal Empire campaign BAM I can put that out straight away the new mod it might come a little bit later maybe next week when I've gotten a bit of chance or towards the end of this week when I've got some chance to install it and test it and make sure everything works fine and I can just apologize my friends profusely for what's happened to you I really really am sorry I'm really upset about it because once again I've had to let you down with a technical issue and I just hate doing that I really do it really does it really does upset me a lot because I know how much many of you sort of subscribed and um, you know enjoy watching particular vi and I feel like I've let you down if you subscribe for a particular thing like this Ottoman campaign I feel like I've let you down then because you've subscribed to see it and all of a sudden I've got to take it away because of this happening um, I wish I could I wish I could really sort it out but this is just this is something that's just absolutely again, once again just keeps keeps catching catching me out here so all I can do is apologize my friends but I can make up for it and you know I'm not one you know we are not ones to be hit and sort of fall down and sort of think okay that's it I surrender not a chance we get up we dust ourselves down and we go again my friends always but that's pretty much where we stand at the moment with the Ottoman Empire campaign 
I really am sorry once again my friends please let me know what you think doesn't matter what it is put it in the description put it in the comments let me know write down what you want to say doesn't matter how long how short it is thumb up anything you like if someone writes down something thumb it up if that's what you want to see more of you know you know go for it just put down whatever you want to see even if it's something I can't get out at the moment it might be something I can do in the future get it down there my friends don't be afraid ever of putting what you think down in the comment section let me know always your comments are really what make this channel tick and make it the beating heart of my channel is you my friends you are what makes this such a fantastic endeavor it really is but anyway friends I'm gonna leave it like that I'm gonna let you do what you do best and that is get down your fantastic comments your fantastic ideas get them down in the comment section get in touch with me any way you want and we'll we'll move on from there my friends and the future will be bright believe me but anyway friends until next time and I can promise you once again a new campaign of some sorts let's hope fingers crossed this one will run smoothly and I'm really do apologize my friends for what's happened this time but I just felt I owed it to you to let you know what's happened to be honest instead of just having it drop and you never see it again you're saying where is it man where's the Ottoman Empire campaign unfortunately my friends we've been beaten once again by the technical gremlins but I hope you've had a great weekend I'll be probably uh, next the next series you'll see now will be the USA campaign. I might even do five episodes of that to make up for the for loss of this Ottoman campaign. So you might see five episodes of that USA campaign. Um, you I won't be able to record now until Monday, uh, Monday evening. So I won't be able to record anything till then. So look out for that probably going up on Tuesday. Um, but again, my friends, sorry for what's happened. Let me know what you want me to do. Have a good week, my friends. Be safe, whatever you're doing. And until next time, bye for now.